is the king of wands. It's fire energy, so it's Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, and it could be the sun, the moon, or the rising sign. Regardless, you'll also be taking on some of the traits of this king of wands, and this is a king who likes to take charge, to make decisions, to be a leader. Uh, he's an entrepreneur, an inventor. He's dynamic. He's energetic. And so those could be traits that are important today. And you may find yourself being very inspiring or fearless or pioneering in your actions, or maybe you're just being rash and impulsive. But whatever it is, you're going after something that you care about, something that's important to you. And this is a day where you may very easily, you know, create your own luck. You're relying on your intuition, uh, you're pushing your ambition, you're intense, you're motivated, and you're resourceful with whatever you're dealing with, whether uh, it's a time crunch or a difficult situation, you are capable of meeting with the pressure. The focus may be on uh, some kind of financial gain or getting recognized professionally for your efforts, your passion. And uh, whatever is coming down the pipe, it's not going to play out quite the way you expect or perhaps according to schedule. But this is a day where you can take charge of a situation, you can close something out, and maybe you even do it more quickly than you even expected. So you're very efficient today, and part of what's helping you get through the day is your sense of humor. Uh, maybe that's cutting the tension or it's putting people at ease to support your efforts or work uh, amicably together. So this is supporting, you know, your assertiveness. You're balancing it out. You know how to be direct, how to take charge, how to be a leader, and you disarm people with your charm, your magnetism, and your humor, or you're connected to someone like that. So this is a day where using your strengths and assets to the best of your ability enables you to get what you want you know, take charge in the meeting, uh, present something and have it receive a favorable response, connect to authority figures and, you know, have that go better than you hoped. So some of you, uh, you're setting the tone for establishing a relationship, even if there are differences. Again, you, you're learning how to smooth that over and use your talents to create the conditions that are ripe for fruitfulness to harvest something. And this may be a day where you have some kind of attraction to someone, whether it's romantic or not. And again, you're seeking that recognition. You want to be seen and heard. And so you may put a concerted effort or go to some extraordinary measure to be seen. And you may be going through those motions without even realizing that you're doing that, but you do want to get the attention of someone in particular. And it's a day where you can earn that respect and that affection. Again, time may be very important to you, and so you're going to structure your time so that you can organize whatever it is that you're trying to do, a project, endeavor, you want to meet deadline. Now, negatively, maybe you don't have so much control. Maybe you don't have as much as you'd like, and it's starting to get under your skin. It's, it's arousing your temper, which is easy to do right now with Mars in retrograde, because those are lessons in um, learning how to effectively direct your energy, what you should be putting your energy into, and also how you deal with conflict. How do you create uh, harmony between yourself and others? And if you can't figure that out, obviously the aforementioned is not going to play out positively. 
you may have difficulty getting your point across, or you may have difficulty communicating or creating a positive um, influence over others or being seen as such. And it may be that you have trouble closing matters out because you're overreaching. Maybe you're scattering your energy and you've started A, B, C, and D knowing full well that you can't complete. And this is going to cause some tension, some disagreements, because obviously not only you, but the people involved are going to be under pressure. So you can make changes today impulsively, rashly, recklessly that you later regret. And it could be that, again, your initiatives are misdirected. You're not on point or you're missing the point. And for some of you, an attraction, a connection that you very much so want is taking so much energy or involves so much intensity that you end up burning yourself out or that relationship out. And, you know, this is very much so like the energy of yesterday when operating in the shadow that the easier people make matters for you, the more they roll out the red carpet or they take on, you know, certain things to make life easier for you, the harder you continue to make things for yourself. So it's a day where your moods may shift. Uh, you know, maybe you're doing fine and then all of a sudden you're angry or you're getting very intense or you're stirring up drama or going to the extreme in a situation. Maybe you blow something out of proportion and in the process you end up embarrassing yourself or other people. So it's a day where that fire energy can either, you know, burn toward securing some kind of goal or completing something in quick time or where that fire energy can you know burn you burn other people uh, through reckless impulsive decisions